Okay, so we're here to make the Timo syrup. This is a recipe by Randy Oliver. And this is to basically treat the sugar syrup. So instead of using Honeybee Healthy, which has lemongrass on it, that is used as a stimulant for the bees to actually go and drink the syrup so they can use it for drawing, uh, drawing some comb or feeding. The problem is in robin season like it is right now, the issue is that that honeybee healthy is going to attract robber bees. So instead of using honeybee healthy, we're gonna use the thymol syrup formula given by Randy Oliver. And of course you wanna use gloves and mask. This is the thymol. This is a 25 gram and 91 isopropyl alcohol. Now, I try to get the Everclear 151 proof, um, but it's not found here in Texas. The nearest one was in California or Florida. I also try to find the 160 proof vodka. Um, so Randy recommends either 91% alcohol or 151 proof Everclear or 160 proof vodka. I've been into a few liquor stores, I couldn't find any or in neither of those. And so I got the next big ten, which is the 91% alcohol. So I already measure. So the formula is 12.5 grams of thymol and 88 milliliters of alcohol. So this is a 25, so I'm gonna prepare double the dose. So it is 25 grams of thymol and 176 milliliters of 91% uh, isopro isopropyl alcohol, right? This will give me a total of 200 mLs, which will actually treat um, 100 gallons of sugar syrup. So this little thing plus the time will, will treat 100 gallons of syrup. You don't want this in your skin. You don't want to inhale this, nothing. So that's why you want to use gloves and protection. And that's what I'm using it outside. Okay, so we'll keep stirring until all the thymol is dissolved and 
that's it this will treat 100 gallons so this is 176 milliliters this is the small bottle so I can actually make double and keep it on the same peanut butter jar so here goes 100 gallons and this will prevent the fermentation of the sugar syrup it is not toxic to the bees and does not have the strong smell of lemongrass that will attract rubber bees so this is going to be the additive to the sugar syrup in every rowing season and that's it it's very humid outside it's Houston so it is humid as you can see and it's done so it's two milliliters per gallon